evening to all you Cabal Vision viewers out there in the old world and beyond. I hope your crystal ball is fully charged, and if not, find yourselves a wizard and chain him to it. Because the 2513 season promises to be one hell of a show, doesn't it, Bob? It sure does. Oh, and iron, Jim. Iron what, Bob? Your shirt? Chains, Jim. Iron chains for chaining up your wizard. Iron is best. It's harder to enchant than steel or silver. Oh, and don't forget to break their fingers as well. Uh, thank you, thank you, Bob. Yes, fascinating. And we may come back to that later. In the meantime, all you sports fans should keep it here on brand new Cabal Vision HD. But what about all you new viewers who are joining us for the first time? How would you explain a game, a blood bowl, to someone who hasn't experienced the joy and delight of it before, Bob. Firstly, I'd say, under what toilet in the realm of chaos have you been hiding? Then I'd begrudgingly explain that blood bowl is a visceral, violent sport where two teams of players must get an inflated pig bladder or ball across a large field into the opponent's end zone by any means necessary to score a touchdown. The catch? There's only one ball, and the opposing team is trying to do exactly the same thing. A match lasts for two halves of eight turns. The team with the most touchdowns wins. Very nicely summed up, Bob. So, what about the teams? It promises to be an interesting season, especially for the Reichland Reavers. Let's remind ourselves by taking a quick look what happened in their final game last year. This is the final game of the last season. The Reavers versus the Cows die. Just look at those human lumps. Why ain't they moving? A frozen spell. Could they not just let it all go? Look at player 16, Josh Kirschman. He just stands there and lets that block mark smack him right in the kisser. They don't seem very spiky in that troll of time, do they? I know. No wonder this team has been won anything in 20 games. There's only so many double skulls going to take. Fans start claiming that's a load of steaming bull. I don't know. <laughs> that was the Reavers. Last public appearance, summing up ten seasons of decline. Why haven't they been fired yet, Jim? That's what I can't understand. The word is, Bob, that J.J. Griswell Jr. hasn't got the cash to replace them. <laughs> yeah? Oh, Griswell was once said to be even richer than you, Jim. He's now down to his last few pennies after paying the likes of Griff Oberwald his massive wage for several decades. I guess he'll just have to put up with using last season's dregs. Anyway, enough yapping. Let's see how they do in this preseason match. Let's see how the Reavers get on. It's their first match, under the leadership of the new coach in a preseason friendly. Never use the word friendly in connection with Blood Bowl, Jim. You'll end up getting sued for false advertising. <laughs> okay, let's take a look. Welcome back, sports fans. Oh dear, this is a totally unmanaged I can't understand what they're even doing on the same field.
Yumi's are a good team. They can pass, catch, hit, and run with the ball. It'll be interesting to see what game they bring today. Is that right? Oh, no, it can't be. In the Reaver's dugout, isn't that the legendary ex-coach, Helmut Zwimmer? Sure is, Jim. Didn't you know, as a favor to JJ, Zwimmer's come out of retirement to mentor the new coach for the first few games. And what about that incident that forced him to leave in the first place? What? That tabloid sting in 04, involving a pair of halflings, jam, and a confused hippogriff? Oh, that was nothing. Nothing was proven. Even in retirement, Helmut's continued to be a loyal ally of the Reavers. Well, he's certainly experienced, Bob. The new head coach should listen to his advice. Ooh, a handoff. How original. The ball is handed off and play continues uninterrupted. Smells like a good old-fashioned hey. fight. They're getting up close and personal, Bob. You need to be close. So close they can smell your breath and see the dead insects ha! in your teeth. He's coming to help his buddy. That's gonna hurt. <laughs> Hey! 
that player's going for it. I can't see Reaver star player and captain Griff Oberwald on the field. <laughs> and where's the mighty fuck? Why is he not ripping my heads off our shoulders? Why are they not here? Haven't you heard, Bob? Ever since his men's fragrance, Gruff by Griff, flopped, he hasn't been seen all off-season. Rumor has it his investors are not happy and want their money back. I tried some of that hmm? scent. What was he thinking? I'm an ogre, and even I couldn't stand the smell. I'd rather take a drag from a goblin's crotch than wear that. What about Zug? Why isn't he here? Zug's so disgusted with the Reaver's performance. But if a Reichland doesn't like Helmut Svitz is back, well, you never know. I don't know. The whole point of the Reaver's glorious devastation and maiming left in Zug's wake. I love a good maiming, me. Safety in numbers. Would you look at that? The Reavers won! Yeah, but the Saints whipped out early. Hold on! I have shocking news. JJ has fired the whole Reavers squad. Not that shocking, Jim. Griswold's having a clear out before the 25-13 season gets underway. One default win against no hopers like the Saints ain't gonna cut it. He should have done it sooner. So if the whole squad's been sacked, Where's this new coach going to find his team, Bob? JJ's a cunning old devil, Jim. My contacts say he can get a whole squad of fresh-faced wannabe new players from the rejects found on that reality Cabal Vision show, Reichland Ain't Got Talent. That sounds like a risky strategy to me, Bob. Risky, Jim? Well, I've seen snotlings come up with more competent plans. 